What's good, fam? Welcome to Tito's Kitchen. In today's episode, we making easy, cheesy, quesadillas. No, no, don't do that. No. All right, well, we making chicken quesadillas. making quesadillas. We're gonna be adding some pico de gallo with it, cilantro sauce, nice robust flavors, cheese, chicken, shrimp. So we about to jump right into it. Let's do it. Okay, this is gonna be quick and simple. Simple ingredients, really quick. We're gonna shred our own cheese. You can use the kind of cheese you like. In this case, we're using Kobe. I'm gonna go ahead and shred it just like that. You can use a food processor. I just like doing the old school way. Next, we're gonna blacken our chicken using 1 4th teaspoon of salt, 1 8th teaspoon of pepper, a half teaspoon of onion powder and garlic powder, 1 teaspoon of paprika, and 1 8th teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Give it that kick. Bow! Add a little olive oil, and we're gonna set that chicken in just like that. We're not gonna move it. That way it's gonna sear nice and good, and get nice and blackened on each side. I want to cook it till the internal temperature is about 165 degrees. All right, time to cook the blackened shrimp. We're going to use that same seasoning combination. We're going to cook about three minutes on each side. The shrimp cooks very fast, so we want to cook it right till it's just done. Mmm, that look good, y'all. All right, shrimp's ready, chicken's ready. Time to build. All right, go ahead and throw you a half teaspoon of butter in there. And I like to put the tortilla down and spin it around just so all the butter goes evenly across the whole surface. We're gonna add our cheese. Then our pico de gallo. Now we're gonna start putting on our chicken. We're gonna put the chicken on one half because we're gonna fold it. Go ahead and add that garlic cilantro sauce. Whew, it's the kicker, it's the kicker. You'll notice it's ready when that cheese starts to melt. Close that up, press it in, flip it on both sides and press it. And we're gonna do the same for the shrimp as well. Do it real quick. Butter, tortilla, cheese, shrimp. Oh, don't forget the pico. Garlic cilantro sauce, let the cheese melt, close it up. And boom, we did it twice, so we should have a hang of it now. Slice this up. I'm gonna go ahead and plate this up so I can get ready for the favorite part of the show. The taste test. And there you have it, chicken and shrimp quesadillas. And we're serving this with some fresh homemade pico de gallo. I actually have a video on this and homemade cilantro sauce which you can also check out right after this video if you want to, but killer, I suggest you check it out though. Now, for the moment of truth, let's do it. I'm gonna start off with this shrimp. Dip it in a little bit. Mmm. This flavoring like every single bite. There's a special kick, a bright kick with the cilantro sauce, the garlic cilantro sauce. And I, I took a bite of the shrimp one first. You can taste the shrimp, the gooey cheese. I mean, this is very delicious. Simple ingredients. The pico, the gallo's coming through. This is very nice. I'm glad I made it. You should make this at home. It's very simple and it tastes great. So, matter of fact, let me try to figure out how I want to eat this. I'm gonna dip it one more time and wild out with it like that. Okay. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mm. Quesadillas. Mm. Chicken and shrimp quesadillas. I mean, the ultimate finger food, y'all. Quesadillas. Don't forget.
forget to like and subscribe and hit that bell so you'll be notified every time I drop a new recipe. Peace.